Hi guys, a quick shave before basketball practice. Are you ready? Whoa, upside down. Elysian Soap Shop, tart and sweet. See you in a sec. Hi guys, thank you for joining me for another Shape and Scent of the Day. This is going to be a quick one uh, because my oldest Reed has basketball practice and I need to get in a quick scrape. Um, so Elysian Soap Shop, this is Tart and Sweet, which is supposed to smell like, um, you know, those little heart candies that say Be Mine and so on and so forth. Um, and notes are Key Lime, White Grapefruit, Green Apple Candy, Blue Tansy, Jasmine, Magnolia, cypress and amber um and it definitely is a beautiful sweet gourmand but it's not it's not crazy sweet it's not like cloyingly sweet and now that i've got some water in it i'm starting to pick up some of the florals in there too which just kind of it gives it some interest you know if it if it just smells like candy you're gonna get bored with it real quick and this gives you something else mmm smells very nice and excited to try this one out um i also have the matching splash i got the alcohol version i don't know why some i like you know some splashes i like not alcohol some i like alcohol i just felt like alcohol this time uh, prometheus handcrafts this is one of my first custom brushes and i love this one too um and it's got a um tanchurian in there i think that one is a v9 i believe um and then mercure 34c and a vodka it kind of wore my neck out uh the other day and it's still kind of bothering me um from wearing a tie and stuff so i just want to get in a mild shave um but i'm ready to get it going so <clears throat> here we go cheers i'm not gonna drink it Yeah, like I said, the uh, floral is now starting to come out a little bit. And it's not like, it's a, it's a very unisex fragrance. Anyone, anyone can use this. Here we go. We get her loaded up. Um, and I have used this base before. I've got Luna. Um, and it's a very nice base. Very enjoyable, nice and slick. provides a very nice um, base to shave with. I guess that's why you call it the shaving soap base, right? Maybe. Nice plastic tub. Um, once again, not my favorite tubs because it's got the indention right here and you get soap back up in here. I know it's only for anal retentive weirdos like me that it's that I, you know, would even say anything about it. But just because I keep it real, here we go. It, obviously, you can tell it has no, it doesn't create any problem with loading it. It's fine. It's just an aesthetic thing for me. But whatever. I'll, I'll let it go. It's a really nice scent. I really enjoy it. I've never bought anything from directly from Shannon, and I wanted to patronize her. Um, so I bought it directly from her. I'm not sure if it went anywhere else or if she was just selling it from her site. But anyway, I got it from her. And here we go. Once again, I've used this space before. I know it will take plenty of water, um, but once again, I am just doing a quick shave here, so I'm not going to get too fussy with it. Um, I'm sure I'll shave with this again, and I'll, you know, give it the super water again. Uh, but here, once again, I'm kind of on a, a time restraint, time constraint. I'm not being restrained yet, but I mean, the night's not over. It's It's still young. Who knows what I could do? Mm. I'm not a huge floral guy and this, you know, the florals do not overshadow in any way. They just kind of add a little more interest 
You know, if you're just sitting around sniffing candy, you're going to get bored with that scent uh, pretty quickly. And this just adds some interest. Very nice. Plus, you know, I'm a big fan of jasmine um, as a floral. And that really sits nice with me in this. All right. I'm already flinging water here. So I'm not going to play with it too much. Uh, a nice low structure lather. We got a ton of shine. I've got a lot of lather on me already. So I think we're good enough. So again, I'm sure I'll shave again with this fairly soon. That's kind of how I feel about this scent. Very nice for a, you know, a mildly sweet gourmand. It's cutesy. Once again, just looking for a mild shave so I can get the material off of my face um, and not cause any more um, irritation. And once again, I'm not saying that it's the shave that's giving me the irritation. It's the necktie and neck of my shirt. I don't know why it's so sensitive right now, but it is. I'm going to assume that it has something to do with the dry, cold weather around here. Picking up just little, just little whiffs of you know, what my nose is picking up is cedar. Um, not anything strong whatsoever, but just, just something that gives a little more depth. And it's like, as I move the razor around here, around my nose, I'm starting to kind of pick that up. I'm sure as it sits and the top notes kind of burn off, I'm sure that that will, you know, strengthen or become more perceptible. But I'm not going to give this a whole lot of time to do that. But I'm not going to wear a scent. Um, so the aftershave, as it sits on me while I'm in Reed's practice, um, hopefully that will kind of open up. You know what? I'm just going to do a quick this way also. I've got about 10 minutes. Yeah, there's definitely a little woods in there now. Not strong, but just detectable. Cedar to my nose comes out. Uh, it's very perceptible to me. I'm going to say it comes out strong to me. Um, it's easily perceived by me. So I can definitely pick that out in there. Um, sandalwood tends to give like a creamy quality to me. I know there are some funk sandalwoods. Um, and I've had some funk before too. But traditionally the ones I like have kind of a creamy nature to them they're not they're not like super harsh like some can be i mean i definitely could add a ton more water to this but 
for a quick tra shave. I'm trying to not be too picky and, you know, as long as it's comfortable and it's doing its job, then that's good. But once again, I could put a lot more water in this. Sorry, I don't mean to spit on you. Well, if you wouldn't sit so close to your TV or phone, I wouldn't have spat on you. Not my fault. Yeah, that on my neck is already a lot more comfortable than um, Monday when I shaved. It was not very comfortable on the last one. I remember seeing some blood coming up right here from the irritation. Has Reed come in and gotten dressed for um, basketball yet? I have a feeling he's going to dunk tonight. By that, I mean if he doesn't pay attention, I'm going to dunk him in the trash can when we get home. That's a no-nonsense shaver. I may give you a lot of nonsense, but this one won't. Very enjoyable. Just gonna get those problem spots on my neck. Try not to overshave them, but once again, I'm wearing a tie again tomorrow, so it needs to be clean there, or else I just create more chafing on my neck. Which, you know, I don't know if you've ever had your neck chafed, but it is not comfortable at all. Be like shaving with a serrated knife. There we go. I may get out of this one unscathed. Really nice soap base. I really enjoy this. That really nice slickness to it. Oh no. I'm trying to not be too fussy here. But it's so hard, especially when you're enjoying the shave. It's hard to cut it loose. All right, we're good there. I'm not gonna take the chance on over shaving and I'm plenty smooth right now. I'm a smooth. I'm smooth. I so smooth right now. Maybe not that smooth, but somewhat. I don't know what that means. Don't ask me. You're the one listening to it. Get this goodness off of here. I already look forward to shaving with this again so I can spend more time with it. That's very nice. Very nice. If you like gourmands, um, I think you'll like this. It's, it's, it's a fun scent. Let me just put it that way. 
I'm not saying it's for babies, though I can act like a baby sometimes. Um, I think it's I think it's very nice because anyone can enjoy it. Very, very nice. Good shave. Little bitty touch right there, but as bad as it felt the other day, this is great. All right, so we've got a spray, um, you know, a pump. So I'll just shake it up and pump a few on my hand. Technically, you could probably spray it right on your face, but I think it would be all over the place. Mm -hmm. mm. This is nice. I'm getting more of the green apple and... Um, and grapefruit in here and i love well i love both of those flavors um and i love the scents too that's nice this is a it's it's really a fun scent you know it's probably not my date night but it's my any other time that is a fun scent it's sweet um, not, not overly sweet once again, uh, but it's sweet, really pleasing to the nose. Um, just a, just a bright, pretty scent. Very nice. And yeah, I'm, I wasn't gonna, I wasn't gonna add a moisturizer, but you know, my skin's been kind of angry. Um, I'm gonna go ahead and add some La Roche Posay. This is the double repair moisturizer. Works great on the nose. Mm. It really smells good. I really like this scent. Whimsical. That's what I'm going. I'm calling it whimsical. Very nice. So this was the Double Repair Face Moisturizer by La Roche-Posay. Really gives you really soft skin, really soft moisturized skin. Thank you guys for joining me. Um, I will see you on BBS Live tonight at 9 o'clock Eastern Time. And I hope you have a great rest of your day. See you on the next one. Peace.